Electrochemical theory of rusting. Due to non-uniform surfaces with strains, commercial forms of iron are not in pure state. Because of this, some portion of iron surface is at lower reduction potential and acts as anode while another portion of iron surface at higher reduction potential acts as cathode. In this way a kind of tiny voltaic cell is set up. Gases such as carbon dioxide, sulfur dioxide, hydrogen sulfides etc. dissolved in water and the solution is believed to act as electrolytic solution. Following electrode reactions take place on iron and produce rust. Oxidation of iron takes places at anodic area and reduction takes places at cathodic area. The electrons liberated at anodic area travels towards the cathodic area through conducting medium. These electrons are consumed at cathode either by the evolution of hydrogen or by the absorption of oxygen depending upon the pH of environment in acidic medium, hydron takes two electrons to form hydrogen. The hydrogen necessary for the reaction is obtained by the ionization of water or carbonic acid. In neutral medium, reduction of oxygen takes place. The ferrous iron obtained from anode and hydroxide obtained at cathode combines to form ferrous hydroxide. In excess of oxygen and water the ferrous hydroxide is oxidized to ferric hydroxide. Being less stable, the ferric hydroxide undergoes decomposition to give hydrated ferric oxides called rust. However, in the limited presence of oxygen the corrosion product may be anhydrous black powder of composition of ferrosoferric oxide Fe304. This is summary of rusting. Oxidation occurs at the anodes of each electrochemical cell. Therefore, at each anode neutral iron atoms are oxidized to ferrous ions. Thus, the metal atoms in the lattice pass into the solution as ions, leaving electrons on the metal itself. These electrons move towards the cathode region through the metal. The electrons are taken up by hydrogen ions. The hydrogen ions are obtained either from water or from acidic substances in water. The hydrogen atoms on the iron surface reduce dissolved oxygen. The ferrous iron obtained from anode and hydroxide obtained at cathode combines to form ferrous hydroxide. In excess of oxygen and water the ferrous hydroxide is oxidized to ferric hydroxide. Being less stable, the ferric hydroxide undergoes decomposition to give hydrated ferric oxides called rust. Therefore, this is the mechanism of rust with the chemical formula Fe2O3.XH2O. Evidence in the favor of the theory. Presence of ferrous ions at anode and presence of hydroxide at cathode have been detected by chemical tests.